Hi, this is Mash Rundown. If you enjoy our movie reviews and trailer reactions, why not subscribe and hit the like button down below. Today we're going to be looking at the trailer for Tom and Jerry. Brings us back to being kids. Uh, we watched a ton of Tom and Jerry. So many Tom and Jerry episodes and so many repeats because like... It was weird. Like when we were kids, it felt like there was never actually a schedule of let's release episode 1 to 50. It was let's release episode 1, 12, 4, 2, 2, 2, 2, 6. Because I felt like I watched the same episode over and over and over and over again. And we also didn't have tons of choices because there were like three or four channels, really. Yeah. Nickelodeon, Cartoon Network, and. Yeah, you had Nickelodeon, <laughs> Cartoon Network. Me? No, I had SABC. And SABC, and that's it. <laughs> Are you excited to see Tom and Jerry on the big screen? I think so. I don't think it will necessarily be a big screen movie. I think it's one of the movies where, you know, if you buy it off of Netflix or well, wherever it's showing, I'm not sure at this point. I think if you buy it off from wherever, it will be fine Yeah. at home. I'm hoping they find a middle ground where they can still make the old school fans happy but reintroduce them to the new generation now. Because it would be nice for Tom and Jerry not to die out. Yeah. It's really fun. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> After it's... a lifetime of being the world's most famous enemies. You can count on oh, me like one, two, three. I'll Tom and Jerry dead. are about to start over. Because that's what friends are supposed to do. Oh yeah. <laughs> In the big city. This hotel has been host to four presidents, three popes, two kings, and we're about to host the wedding of the century. Oh. Do you think you're qualified to take on this position? I shine under pressure, like a diamond. Poor Rihanna. <laughs> One other thing. I hate we have a mouse problem. But then what now? I'll catch it, sir. Everybody gonna shine. I was more like this, don't even gotta try. Oh, wow, this is so detailed. We could hire an exterminator. Or we can leverage millions of years of predatory evolution. That the bed is A picture of this mouse is tweeted out to Instabook Face or Tiki Talk. We will be ruined. No, sir, that's not gonna happen. That rodent is toast. I will not let this hotel be ruined by a cat and a mouse. I think I might have just pulled this off. Really? We blowing up the whole thing. Everybody in the bouncy house for a bouncy, bouncy. So disappointing. <laughs> the only thing that's a pro for me is they kept the silent interaction between Tom and Jerry. Definitely. Space Jam did it well. The cartoon and human interaction. That was pretty well done. That was very good. I enjoyed Space Jam. It does look a little out of place here though. The it looks animation. Very out of place, yeah. Space Jam was a lot brighter and they tried to mesh the cartoon with reality. It doesn't feel like that this has done a mesh. It feels like there's cartoon and then there's reality and somehow they're together. Like almost the ones put on top of the other. Yeah, I'm not actually expecting much from this. I don't even want to watch it. I'm so disappointed. <laughs> wow. It doesn't seem like there was a lot of hype about this, unless I missed it completely. So I'm assuming there wasn't a lot of hype for a reason. Yeah, because of the way they've done this. I don't know what I expected, but it was not that. Yeah, I mean, I'll watch it, but I know exactly where it's going. And 
I know exactly what it's going to be. It's not going to be great. It's going to be slapstick. You like that. You'll still have fun. I'm probably going to hate it. That being said, Tom and Jerry was slapstick, the cartoon. It wasn't well thought out anything. It was just slapstick. So I feel like we just had Roald Dahl's movie recently with the mice in the hotel. And now they're doing the exact same thing, the mice in the hotel. It feels like a bit too close to that as well. Let us know in the comments down below. Are you happy with the choice to go mixed reality and cartoon? Or would you have preferred it to just be a straight cartoon? Don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button down below. Bye. Later.